This is Edgar of Tech Command Repairs coming to you with another tip. So I had a lot of people asking how to respread the liquid metal on their APU on their PS5. All you need is some isopropyl alcohol, uh, 91 to 99%, and some cotton swabs or some Q-tips. First you want to do is wet the cotton swab or the Q-tip with some alcohol because the liquid metal is going to run from it. As we can see here, I'm starting out from the outside and just pushing it all into the center. I'm trying to make it into one little ball. So everything that's around the outside of the APU, I'm trying to get into the center. Cleaning up the APU, removing all that liquid metal, cleaning up the APU itself, wiping it down. You'll start to notice on the other side of the Q-tip, it'll be dark and black. It means it's wiping off all that oxidation. So you want to get all of that into one ball, try to get up as much as you can. Once it's in a ball, we're going to wet the other side and we're going to clean off this APU itself, the top part of the dye. We wet it with some more isopropyl alcohol, it said 91 to 99 percent. Don't forget that you need that. That is dry it off with the other side of the Q tip or cotton swab. Once it's dried off, what we're going to do is take another Q-tip that's dry and start spreading that little ball all around the top of the APU. You want to go in circular motions just to, as if you're painting it on. You start noticing the difference. You start seeing it start to spread and take hold. Keep spreading it until it's completely covered the APU. Take your time. Don't rush through it. Just make sure you get all the corners, all the pieces, all the edges. You want it to be nice and all over there. I like to go back over and make sure it looks nice, nice little smooth top, it's mirror like. I'm going to swap this out. We're going to go to the heat sink now. I'm going to bring that over. Now, once we have the heat sink, we're going to do the exact same thing. We're going to get a new cotton swab or q tip, wet that with the 91 to 99% isopropyl alcohol, and we're going to go around the outside of this uh, heat sink itself just to get all of the liquid metal into. A nice bowl. We're going to clean that up, make sure we have all that liquid metal there because we don't want to, to squirt out or move anywhere else because this liquid metal is highly conductive. So you want to make sure we keep it on the die, make sure we get up as much as we can, just put it right into one bowl. We're going to clean off the AP, well, the heat sink as much as we can. See it evaporates, that's because alcohol has a lower evaporating point than water does. So now that we have it cleaned off, we're just going to go around this same way we do on the APU, just circular motion in order to respread it on top of this heat sink, top of this die here. So what your liquid metal is doing is moving the heat from the APU, which is on the board, because it gets hot when it's working putting it into this side of the board so that it's attached to the heat sink and those fins and then your fan itself blows cooler air over that to remove all that heat to keep the system working at proper temperatures. Now once we have all that done there, it looks nice. We're going to put the board back in to test everything out. We put everything back into the system just to make sure it actually boots up testing that it's not overheating just from the main menu if you play a game it will overheat so you don't want to do that put everything back together if you don't know how to put it back together i don't know how you took it apart in the first place but if this tip was good for you and you liked it hit that like button subscribe if there's any more tips you want to know about leave it down below in the comment section i'll be sure to get back to you, but i'll see you in the next video